I've been having a blast working with uh, all kinds of outboard gear and a hybrid setup. It took a long time to hook a bunch of things up and get stuff in my patch bays and organize the patch bays and get things the way I wanted it. I'm still not sure the best way I want to work, but at least I'm having a real good time now as things are starting to flow. I had so many memories of what I used to do on a console before I was using Logic and being in the box. And then I got used to so many fantastic options and things you can do in the box that I wasn't sure how I wanted to use the console again. So I recorded these drums to tape. I have this one inch 16 track. And I went through some compressors and various EQ and things as I printed and played the drums. Then, um, you know, just singing, playing the other parts, micing amplifiers, the usual things. I really enjoyed going through my Tegler preamps. I did some things through the console preamps. I have the uh, recording channel and the VTRC. And then here on this mix, I figured I would mix through the console and in the box. So I could do all the high pass and low pass thing quite easily on the computer. I could send things out to the mixer in stereo pairs. But I still wanted to use the EQ on the console and I also wanted to play with the faders. A lot of folks recommend that you keep everything at zero, don't use the EQ, all kinds of good tips for instant recall if you have to make changes, but I was printing back into my Logic session, and if I have to make changes, I might just add extra changes in Logic. I wanted to have fun with the board the way I wanted to have fun with the board. And I am the artist, so I know what I'm looking for. I don't often need that many changes. I don't give myself a hassle. <laughs> hey. <laughs> anyway. It's been working really well. I um, recently picked up two distressers, so I sent the vocals out through those extra buses that the console has where you can put different things into each bus and get some extra stuff. So I have some Mog EQ happening on the vocals. I have the distressers happening on the vocals. I had the, um, the cream working on the acoustic guitar and electric guitar on the piano. So yeah, it's really, really fun. And like I said, the, the options are just crazy and, and so, so many. <laughs> but you can't get it wrong. You're just having fun. So enjoy. Just play with the toys and have fun. <laughs>